Shy, Shy vs. A Bike Podcast, goddamn episode 101. <laughs> Niggas out the motherfucking two digits into the three digits, man. Got the homie, dog. Rapper, actor, motherfucking Sev. Oh, yeah. Uh, AKA uh, uh, J, J New. What up, dog? AKA Gator and shit. Oh, get- yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You know, I still do research. Even though it's your second time, I still yeah, research shit. No, dog. Hey, don't nobody know that. That's the first time I heard a nigga <laughs> told me that. That's crazy, no, though. That's hell crazy. yeah, hell yeah. Last time. This is the second time coming on the uh, show, man. Mm-hmm. Last time I came on this motherfucker air, uh, January 27th, earlier this year. It was episode 56 that he was on, dog. So, shit, we ain't came a long way and shit, dog. Yeah, like a motherfucker. You had, you, now you at the end of the year, last year, you was at the top of the year, so. Yeah, yeah. You yeah. on this motherfucker, dog. Always. Shit. Feel you already know, man, that. before we start, dog, got to do a salute, man. Salute me while I'm here. Oh, for sure. You know the sure. qualifications, nigga. Can't uh, do nobody that's personal like mom, pops. Brother, sister, gotta be somebody all that shit, dog. Um, shit, for the most part, man, I just want to salute to everybody that's been giving me a chance, man. Oh, like, shit, hell yeah. you know, the, the, the music producers, the movie producers, the directors, there's everybody that's been holding me down. I mean, without them, there's no me for real. I know, for so sure. So, just everybody that's supporting me, the fans, and everybody that's been holding me down. So, that's mm-hmm. just 100 for real. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Shout to them. Hell yeah, man. Shit, I ain't got, damn, I ain't got no, I always gotta think of somebody to salute, though. I'm a salute, nigga. I'm a so, uh, high school motherfucking athletes, dog. Okay, Just cause uh, I'm about to go. Right. My son, he played uh, high school ball now. He in ninth grade. Okay. I'm about to go watch him hoop and shit. His team kind of trash, but he's straight. Oh <laughs> man, do better, my nigga. Do yeah. Better. So uh, okay. I'm gonna salute uh, just the youngest dog, cause just take that shit serious, bro. Cause yeah. you gonna look up and. The four years gonna be over. Yeah, it is. It is. It's gonna be over, dog. You know what? You know what? I-, I got one more salute too. Go ahead. Salute, young Dolph. And everybody from Paper Route Empire, man. Mm-hmm. When you, we lost a real nigga, man. Memphis. Mm-hmm. I, I'll be home in a couple weeks too, Memphis. I'm gonna go visit, you know, no, for sure. the street after him and shit. Hell I'm gonna yeah. go uh, visit that and just pay homage, or whatever. But shout out to Dolph and the whole his family and everybody in the whole Paper Route Empire and shit for real. It's, for real. it's crazy you say that, dog. Cause that was one of my questions for you, nigga. We might as well start from there. Yeah. Got new. Last episode, you said you lived in Memphis for a little bit, dog. Yeah, yeah. So you you know firsthand, like shit, how that, that shit probably affected, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Affected them out there, dog, because mm-hmm. he was a he was a you know saying big name and shit. Yeah, you were. So you, yeah, were. So yeah, so yeah, you you know people that like kind of like bump shoulders man, with him. Yeah, man, like it's it's crazy because when he died, I was just I was over at my girl house with well, my female friend house, and we we <laughs> over there kicking over there. <laughs> we over there kicking it, and uh. uh we was listening to his music and she was like man he tried to sound like gucci man i'm like don't disrespect dog yeah, like yeah, for sure. you know yeah. what i'm saying because you know i when i moved to memphis i ain't really have a favorite rapper it was just him and star lido i listened to out of memphis for sure so i'm like man Dolph so slept on but the nigga be in the hood all the time he yeah. giving back that nigga was inspirational he was a mm-hmm. motivational motherfucker and i'm like man i fuck with memphis and i fuck with Dolph. Yeah, yeah, yeah. so when my girl texted me she was like uh they killed Dolph. i'm like what yeah. Like, get the fuck out of here. I checked Instagram. I seen the whole live, and then police was lined up down the street, like 27, 20 some police cars. I'm like, damn. Hell yeah. And then how they got him, it was sad too, because they called him at a cookie store. Yeah, well, he was supporting this shit. The yeah. little local, little shit. Yeah, dog. Yeah, I'm like, man, that, they did that boy crazy. Man, for real. But then, because I got put on him, dog. I think my uh, my, my little brother always put me on, like, on, on niggas who I be, you know what I'm saying, slept, sleeping on. Yeah. Because the only people I already knew from Memphis that I was heavy on was uh, 3 6. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Coming up, nigga, like my my stepbrother, shout out to my dog, True. Mm-hmm. This nigga used to bump 3 6. I'm talking about not when they won the motherfucking uh, uh, Oscars and sh- Grammys and shit. Then, I'm talking yeah. about four, nigga, when it was like, nigga, nine niggas on that motherfucking mm-hmm. dog. So that's when they was like, nigga, I remember when nigga I used to walk through the hallways with his chick. And my brother always be singing, nigga, don't save her. Cause he, she was a little, little thotty and shit, dog. Like, yeah, so that's my my intro to motherfucking Memphis was them. Yeah. Then, of course, Gotti. Oh, then, yeah, of course. Yeah. Then I started listening to uh, Dolph, like, Nigga had his his shit together, bro. Like he had a little camping and shit, and he mm-hmm. was doing some things, dog. Mm-hmm. But do you think like once you become like at a certain level, not even money wise, just shit being known and money, like you Man. think you should just like say fuck the city, period, dog? Man, it's, this is the thing, though. Like regardless of this rap shit, you gotta be smart. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? You gotta move militant. Mm-hmm. Like you see Dirk, he move about 20, 30 <laughs> niggas everywhere he go. You know what I'm saying? Little sure. baby do the same shit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So it's just like. They they 
they shot him beforehand. Yeah, yeah, And yeah, then yeah. they shot up the nigga truck. Yeah, yeah, So I think he didn't live in Memphis at the time, but he had people in Memphis and yeah, his yeah. relatives stayed there. He was coming back to give turkeys away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So they just called him lacking, but you could tell that they was on him. Yeah, for sure. You know what I'm saying? And yeah, I ain't, yeah. I don't want to say too much or nothing, man, about it, because, you know, oh, no, I don't no, know no, shit yeah, about yeah, it, yeah, but yeah. Man, it, it had to be somebody close that knew some more about the situation than yeah. what they were acting like they did. Man, that shit be fucked up, dog. Like, when you, because you want to come back to the hood, bro, when you make it. Yeah, it's the, the hood, oh, nigga. Man. Like, you've yes. been there all your life bro yes you know what i'm saying like the shit with t grizzly with his aunt and shit like that mm -hmm. his manager like it'd be fucked up bro that you can't go back to the crib and just nigga kick and have a good time yeah you gotta yeah. look over your shoulders at all times bro like you, for yeah. real for real you gotta yeah. come you gotta come in and come out like you motherfucking batman like nigga you know what i'm yeah, saying you in and out it's like yeah. a robbery for real for in real dog. Like a robbery. yeah man rest in peace to Dolph, dog uh -huh. now uh it's 2021 bro you was here earlier in the year, dog. Yeah, you was yeah. talking about the, the year, dog. How, how that shit been for you, dog? Man, I ain't gonna lie, man. Since the last time I've been here, shit been beautiful, man. Mm -hmm. I've been getting calls back to back about about movies. Mm -hmm. I got some shit out in Cali. Somebody trying to push my music. Shout out to you, my nigga. Yeah, for <laughs> sure. Shout out to <laughs> yeah. in Cali. My Cali people doing they, they thing. For sure. People been noticing me more. People yeah, been yeah, noticing yeah. my camp, my niggas I've been around and shit. Mm -hmm. Family been more supportive, man. Um, you know, wiser too. Working yeah. on physical health and mental health. You okay, know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah, so, for sure. I oh, got to, got to. Yeah, everything just been great. Everything been smooth for real, though. Yeah, because, nigga, that, that mental, nigga, that shit's serious, bro. Yeah, you got to be stable at all, at all times, man. Yeah. You got to be straight up here because yeah. this music and this movie shit will take you to a different place. Mm hmm For real. So, like, like do, do real life ever get in, in the way of, like, like, your mental, though? Like, because, like, I know, like, compared man. to last year, nigga, I was doing this show. But nigga, I was unhappy to the motherfucker, dog. The mm -hmm. job I had, nigga, wasn't paying shit. You struggling, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Week to week, dog. So that shit can get to you when with the other stuff that you do. Your podcast might not be as good, nigga. Mm -hmm. I'm coaching. I right. might not be as focused. So like the real life ever getting away, your music or your motherfucking acting shit? Um, yeah, man, to be honest, man, you know, this week was crazy for me. Like yeah. I had a, a foot procedure on I had a foot oh, yeah, procedure I mean, yep, on, yep, yep. on my foot recently and my grandma just passed away. Oh shit. I had rest a winter funeral. Yeah, thank you. I just went to her funeral, Damn. um, yeah, uh Monday. Yeah. And um I had to come here and I'm going out of town next week. Yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying? So and I gotta finish up the album when I first come back here okay so it's like you know that's a lot of me pushing and me a lot of, i gotta be stable and just free minded for that Hell yeah shit. for sure i gotta really just be in a place of peace like yeah. i'm i'm happy yeah but i gotta be i have a peaceful state of mind yeah yeah, yeah. Uh, so i can't yeah. be sad and stressed out about shit no so yeah that, that, that shit, shit getting away bro like that shit fuck up everything nigga. even like i got kids like how you act towards your kids nigga oh uh, yeah the yeah, little yeah. shit they do you be mad <laughs> <laughs> like right but you right, gotta chill yeah, bro you, you gotta chill you can't take shit. that negative energy out on nobody else no for sure Sometimes you just gotta be by yourself and just you balance all that shit out yeah yeah and like my shit always been like to get my mind clear bro like hooping like yeah. hooping okay like the studio even though i don't be rapping like that no more nigga like I'm sorry, you <laughs> you be snapping, my nigga. Duh, duh. Hey, hold on. You be snapping. This though. nigga hit me up one time like, dog, your shit cold, but you gotta stop saying the f word. <laughs> you remember that shit, dog? Yeah, they gonna censor your ass. <laughs> they gonna block your page, bro. No, they gonna for stop real. you, nigga. I'm duh, telling you. I like that shit, bro. But as far as music, dog, I'm just too cheap, dog. What, what you mean cheap? Like dog, yeah, it's, it costs a lot to be to do music, dog. I'm quite oh. sure you know. Oh yeah, definitely. Dog, definitely. With, with music, going to studio, videos, promotion, beats. like yeah, yeah that shit could be a lot, dog. Oh yeah, it's not a cheap, it's not a cheap hobby. Yeah, yeah. And, and it wasn't until I did this because dog, when I first did the podcast shit, it was to push the music shit. Right. And I'm like, all right, if I meet niggas who do music, we can I get my shit out. But then I'm like, nigga, man, I'm good. Fuck this. I like mm -hmm. doing the podcast shit. Like I do it. Like I say, I was gonna. Uh, I was gonna drop a, a, a project, dog, on my birthday in the summertime. Mm -hmm. And then shit, just let it do what it do, dog. I might even fuck around and do a show or two, dog. Like, you know what? And that's the <laughs> that's, that's the best part, performing out yeah. of all this shit, bro. For the real? videos is cool, but the performances be just, it be live and you get to interact with the females. You get to see how the niggas banging your shit. Yeah, and then yeah. people show support to that shit. For sure. Hell so, yeah. Them shows is where it's at. Shit, though. staying on the year, dog. What's your, you, you got any, like, you know, niggas always got goals for the next year. Like, I'm gonna work mm -hmm. out, work out for two weeks and shit. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna eat better, nigga, eat a couple of motherfucking green leaves and shit for a couple. Right. What's the goal you got next year, dog? Uh, go, uh, what's, what's my goal? Uh, one is to keep uh, having multiple sources of income. Yeah. Always, always keep more than one source of income. So I got three right about now. I'm really moving. Okay. Uh, to learn more about, uh, man, to get more literate with this, with, with the whole branding and just marketing mm -hmm. and stuff like that. Like for a little sure. bit more just, you know, learning how to make more money from my music and all. Oh yeah. You facts. know what I'm saying? So, Hell yeah. yeah, so that's, that's, that's one goal. Um, 
I ain't gonna lie, man. I'm gonna try to settle down with just one female. <laughs> I'm gonna try to settle down. My moms and my sister be on my ass about that shit and want to have one, one female. And I be trying to tell them, like, listen, ma. <laughs> listen, listen, sis. It's just more about me having a, a peaceful state of mind. Like, I gotta have my mind peaceful. Like, yeah, for sure, for sure. No, no distractions. I gotta stay focused, yeah. man. Yeah, because what y'all shit, what you do. You gotta have that right, the right lady for real, for real. Yeah, you understand. She gotta understand. Yeah, cause they don't understand, nigga. It's gonna, like you said, it's gonna be messing with your mental, mm -hmm. nigga. That's gonna be a distraction, yeah. cause dog. Yeah. A female could be a distraction like a motherfucker. Oh yeah, man. Thought I found love, but I found the distraction. <laughs> Bitches all love my business. You don't even know what happened. <laughs> Stacking all my money. Oh, okay, I'm stopping. That, <laughs> that, that that's for the new shit though. But that's no. on, that's on some new shit yeah, for y'all no. motherfuckers. So see, yeah. like, like with that shit, like you just gotta have somebody that understand. What you doing, bro? Like, and like, not even, like, damn, what the fuck you had said? Like, yeah, you gotta have a, a balance between it all. Cause uh, having a woman takes a lot of attention. You gotta give her attention, time, sure. and you gotta show support and all that stuff. And it's like, you gotta do this music shit. There ain't no just clock in, clock out yeah, job. Yeah, this yeah. is, it's a marathon. No, this shit sure. don't really stop. So it'll be unfair for me to have a woman and I can't give her all the time and attention she needs. Mm -hmm. So if a woman understand that and just let me get to my ground, we gonna be good. Yeah, just let sure. me do me. Now, let me ask you this though, cause me and uh, producer Q and shit was talking though. Mm -hmm. I had like, you ain't seen that. I had some females on the show that was, you know, some attractive young ladies and shit dog. <laughs> Man. <laughs> yes. So it's like with me, that's Man. how I know. I'm chill yeah. because I don't even be. Nigga, you ask this nigga dog, he can attest to it, dog. Like I've been married for a year and a half, bro. Now yeah. I'm just like, I'm be cool, bro. Like the old me probably would try to jump on anything, nigga. Like, right, but right, me right. now, nigga, I'm blessed and shit, dog. <laughs> <laughs> like, dog, like I'm just, I'm just cool. With everybody will come on the show, bro. That's that's it, dog. Like I make sure pictures don't be too close. <laughs> yeah, you gotta you gotta move right, man. Yeah. Wifey watching. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Even when she not watching, you know she. You know she watches it some type of way, dog. Oh, yeah. Somebody definitely. gonna watch for her. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they got eyes. They yeah. always got some eyes. Because, dog, one time we had, you know, one chick uh, came on, nigga. When she went outside, nigga, the whole block was like some gorillas, nigga. Like, mm. hitting this nigga up, like, dog, who was that, nigga? Are you probably talking about, uh, <laughs> she be on Instagram giving away money or something. You talking about her? Oh, uh, no, no. That was a fake page. And she, and she, um, she got hat. Oh you, yeah, you, you probably talking about uh, Leah Bands. <sighs> Leah Bands, nah, that's, <laughs> nah, nah, she she was nice. She could really rap too. No, no, she's great. Yeah, yeah. she's really nice. Yeah. Like when she came over here, nigga, um, I hear her because I seen her. Uh, <laughs> I saw her on uh, Detroit uh, rap news or some shit. Yeah, yeah. So like, yeah. I see a lot of people like with dudes and females. I hit them up like, whatever, whatever. And she came through and jumped all, but I, now, yeah, niggas out here. If you come over here, nigga, you a female and it's warm outside. It's gonna be some niggas outside on the block. Oh bro. yeah, oh yeah, yeah. You have some attractive females on here, brother. <laughs> shout out to Detroit Diamond too, man. I'm gonna always shout that one out, man. No. See, <laughs> I'm always shout my now, first out. See, now I was That's gonna baby right that there. That was something that I was gonna uh, I was gonna ask you later on in the show, dog. Oh yeah, okay. Well. So uh, y'all did the video sometimes. <laughs> yeah, we definitely did the video sometimes. <laughs> hey nigga, we was we was clowning, dog. When she was yeah. on here, I'm like, dog, we had pit derby shit and a little, oh, little yeah. jig, a little jig, oh. dog. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga said jiggles. <laughs> so dog, when you do a video like that, bro, and shit like, like nigga, how do you act, nigga? Like, like you act like you don't want this motherfucker. Like, I mean, you, you acting like you want it, but in mm. real life, it just, it just a video. Y'all just acting. Like, right. you ever ha come across like, it could been that one. Like, like damn, like this motherfucker, she, she, she well, the truth for real. Like, oh, well, with her, it was more so just being professional. So she carried herself a certain way. Mm -hmm. So it was more so like I made sure she was comfortable. Did she need something? For sure. I told her, no, I, I, I paid her a deposit. You know, mm -hmm. everything was really professional. For sure. And it was kind of like, well, I'm just gonna be touching you here, grabbing you here. Yeah. Everything is cool. You got a boyfriend. She's like, no, nah, it's cool. Nah, yeah, nah, yeah, I can't yeah. walk up. We just gonna make this shit look realistic. Yeah, 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 yeah. And one thing about her, nigga, she about that shit for real. No, like, for sure. You know, yeah, if, she if for real. If the shit didn't look good, she said, no, I want this like this. I need you to do this, and I need you to do this. So yeah. when I, I hired my photographer mm -hmm. and I hired my cameraman, they pretty much pretty much directed her. For sure. So then she was telling me what she needed, so I had to go back and tell them what I needed. Yeah. So it was just like, you know, we just all worked. No, she bought her shit. Team. Yeah, so we, it, it, was, it was really good. She really professional, man, but... Yeah. It was really just acting, man, but it looked it really good on camera. Yeah, just yeah, like yeah. just just the other day I hit her like, man, you know, you did your thing in that. Mm -hmm. And we actually was gonna work again, uh, but I had got uh casted for another movie. Okay. So I didn't know how long it was gonna be till we started on our new project yeah, or whatever. Yeah, 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 yeah. Cause I'm like, nigga, I'm like, damn, like, say, whatever, motherfucker. Man, that video <laughs> was lit, boy. Nigga, that nigga, was lit. Nigga, bad time on his move, shoot the motherfuckers. <laughs> 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 yeah. Anyway, I just shot the uh, dive. I just talked yeah, to her earlier, dog, her, yeah. cause uh, I had 
had posted something. She was like, yeah, you gonna get that shit. Like your shit gonna be good. And that's one person nigga like that said she really she the homie. Like yeah, I always go back and forth with her. You know what I'm saying on, on IG talking and shit though. Like mm-hmm. I got her. Uh, I threw a little oop for her to be on another another podcast and shit. Mm-hmm. Though. I well. think you should fuck with these niggas too. All these twins named SJ and AJ. SJ and AJ. They got uh, uh, the connected experience. I think somebody follow me like that soon. Like yeah, not these twins long. and shit. They they uh some cool dudes, dog. Like for real, for real. Okay, okay. Yeah, so yeah, but yeah, dog. Yeah, that shit. I'm I always wonder like when you acting like nigga, that shit be kind of hard. Nigga, we got somebody that's really attractive. Uh, nigga. Yeah, and you know she had on the lingerie. Mm-hmm. She had on two fits and she was in the water and she was throwing her hair back and, and we just was like, man, this is crazy. I ain't want the video to end. <laughs> we was in the room for about two, three hours though, yeah, trying yeah, to yeah. shoot this shit, getting everything together though. But yeah, that was yeah. a hell of a experience. Shout out to D- the Detroit Diamond though. Yeah, real, yeah, real I thought y'all would have did like a remix to that shit, okay? Man, I want to get on the track with her so bad because she's so fire. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Like, she fire, nigga. She spit a freestyle over uh, one of Nipsey beats, I yeah. believe. And I'm like, damn, like, no, she came she up with that shit all hand. Like, yeah. yo, like, she, 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 she sick with it. Hell yeah, hell yeah. Shout out her, dog. Shout out her. Now, you just say, like, you just lost your grandma and shit, dog. And yeah. then we got the holidays coming up, so that could be tough when you got somebody as a staple in the family and junk. Yeah. So, like, give me a, uh, Christmas coming up, bro. Like, mm-hmm. give me a Christmas memory, bro. Like, that's a bad one, a good one, dog. That you remember and shit, dog. Uh, well, a good Christmas memory is when, you know, I was always bad as hell in school. <laughs> Always fighting and getting kicked out and shit. But it just seemed like no matter how bad of a kid I was, my mama, my grandma, and my brother always just look out for me like I was a good ass kid. So (laughs) I had, (laughs) I had, I had, uh, I used to play video games and basketball. So okay. when I, I got off of the basketball, playing video games and shit, like, well, playing video games and playing basketball with the video games. For sure. I wanted to have a basketball rim. Yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. I was a little nigga. Yeah, so yeah, I'll yeah. go up to uh, Nevada, I'll go to the park, and I'll shoot, and the big niggas are roaming me off the court yeah, and shit. So I sure. couldn't really hoop. So, yeah, so yeah. my brother worked at, a, I think, Walmart or somewhere like that, and uh, he bought me a basketball rim, him and my yeah. mom, and they got me a basketball rim. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I said, nigga, I got a whole basketball yeah, yeah, rim in my nigga. backyard. Yeah, for sure. It's over with, yeah, nigga. Yeah, I'm not going nowhere. That's I was staple. I bet to the, niggas coming to your crib too. Nigga, yes, nigga. My block was the block, nigga. Helen niggas knew they oh, came shit, on Helen my block. Oh, uh, Helen, yeah, having Helen. Uh, so you got seven miles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, good. it's that little court, like, like, like in the middle and shit, kind of like. Well, right? yeah, yeah. I, I was over there in, okay. in that area. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So, Kinda, it's a coach over there. Oh yeah. Yeah, that little school right there on Helen. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's yeah. Called, yeah. Uh, it's called. It's uh, called Jefferson Stone? Douglas. Not yeah, Cornerstone. Oh, it yeah. was Cornerstone. Yeah, it's, it's a Cornerstone school, but it's called like Cornerstone Jefferson Douglas. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So, I remember that. Yeah. Hell yeah, dog. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Dog, ain't that like the motherfucking Christmases when you really want some? And you, you get you that get, shit. You get and, that shit. Yeah. And you expect the nigga. Right. Like dog, my son, he going with his mom for the holidays. She in Florida, mm-hmm. so his birthday on the thirteenth for December. So mm-hmm. I gave him my like, nigga. I know you are gonna be with your mama for a week or two. I gave him his shit for you know his Christmas gift and his birthday gift right there. Mm-hmm. Nigga, nigga had the PlayStation Five. Nigga like, damn, you got me this bitch. Oh shit! And I, to, and I got tax nigga on that bitch dog. I know you did. It wasn't that bad because some niggas doing it for a thou. I got it for seven fifty. No, it ain't. So yeah. it's extra, it's extra two fifty dog. Cause some niggas getting hit with that bitch dog. Oh, they is. Got that, that motherfucker. Is. And uh, I set that shit up somewhere, and they were like, dog, you got that bitch? Like, basically, you got that shit, nigga? Like, <laughs> so it felt good for me to make my little nigga, like, happy know, right? and shit, nigga. Yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying? So he be doing shit, dog, and they got phone, they got a couple of dollars, nigga. Got, I'm like, yeah, nigga, you, you got away, nigga. You gotta have a little homie straight. So, nigga, so, nigga, you, you talking about nigga moms and sister on your head about the family, I mean, about, about, the, about the girlfriend and shit. Yeah, yeah. so you, you, you don't be thinking about, like, like you want a, a little self, nigga? Uh, man, I, I I definitely gotta leave my mark here while I'm mm-hmm. while I'm gone. But it don't be so much about you no know, the kid. It's just the woman. I'm picky. I yeah, gotta be with this sure. woman forever. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so it ain't gonna be just a chick that I'm just I'm smashing the John John, yeah, and I'm yeah. just gonna be like, all right, well we got a kid now. I'm just gonna nah. It's like we gonna be. It's gonna be planned. I'm gonna sure. love the woman. Yeah. I'm gonna set the foundation. We gonna get a house, yeah. have the business running. We gonna have a kid now because I'm gonna be around while she, through sure. her pregnancy. Yeah. I want to be that type of father. Yeah, yeah, you know what I'm sure. saying? Hell so yeah. you and know, she gonna have out the blue though. You ain't gonna. It's gonna hit you like, damn, man. Mom, in love. Ah, <laughs> shout out to the one I really love, man. She know who she is. Just <laughs> everybody's stubborn nowadays, but it is what it is, man. You gonna send that clip right to her, like? Dog, <laughs> 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 no, that shit funny as hell, dog. Yeah. Now, last thing I'm gonna talk about, dog. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That ain't, you know, ain't too uh, uh, mentally health topics and shit like. Yeah. But like, though, what's one thing you can say you learned about yourself this year, bro? That you like, damn, for real. Yeah, like shit. I I can I have to learn how to take criticism. 
Oh yeah, that shit hard. Yeah, I had to learn how to say, you know what? They right. Yeah. Maybe I need to stop doing this. Maybe I gotta step back and evaluate myself. Cause my whole thing was this. Everybody's not titled to their opinion about me because your mm -hmm. opinion could be disrespectful. Mm -hmm. So if you say something about me in a disrespectful, I'm gonna react in a disrespectful for way. For sure, for sure. You know what I'm saying? And I'm not sensitive, I'm easily insulted. Yeah, so yeah, you yeah. can't just talk to me any type of way. I think it's all good. Yeah, yeah you know yeah. what I'm saying? Like if you don't like my music, fuck you, nigga. You know <laughs> yeah, I don't yeah, like you, but sure. I gotta say, well, okay, it's cool. My music isn't for you. Yeah, yeah. You know, yeah, so I'm sure. just learning how to just just self control, if yeah. you will. Yeah. And that's some shit that I think I need to work on too, as far as like just, just like not giving a fuck what niggas think, dog. Because sometimes, but when you so passionate about something, dog, it should yeah. be hard. Oh yeah, bro. yeah, like, that shit hard. Man, like not tell me if a nigga say fuck your mom, you ain't gonna say, well, you you don't know my mama. <laughs> I'm gonna let that shit slide. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Nigga, we finna scrap, nigga. No, for like, sure. You know what I'm saying, nigga? Like, I'm gonna disrespect talk? you. I'm gonna you smack you, nigga. Yeah, like, nigga, nigga's gonna get serious, nigga. Yeah, real yeah. serious right now. Hell you yeah. Feel me? Hey, yeah. So yeah, if you don't if you don't rock with Sam, just don't say shit. <laughs> It is what it is. Nigga man. hurt your ass, <laughs> nigga, for real, dog. Hell yeah. yeah now, nigga, man. on the on the rap shit, bro, we didn't talk about this shit when you was on here, but like, do you who was your first favorite rapper, dog? Like when you young and you don't know shit, you just like whatever. Mm. Like, you remember who your first favorite rapper was, dog? Man, I gotta break that down because it was first nigga I saw that I wanted to be like that maybe wanna jump in this shit was was Diddy when he was puffy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Benzes yeah, yeah. and the Flash shiny shoes shit. and shit. I'm like, man, I wanna be I wanna do what that nigga doing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought it was rapping, but it was just making money for real. <laughs> yeah, for real. So <laughs> yeah, so <laughs> then it was I'ma just say Lil Wayne. Yeah. Lil Wayne had to be the most Nigga. Yeah, like it's Lil Wayne. Like yeah. that's it says it is. Well, and then think about it, that nigga been cold forever, bro. Man, yeah, it been cold forever. Like, Since he was fourteen. Like you knew back then, like, oh this nigga Juvie he, Juvie and BG was a shit, but yeah. you knew that nigga Wayne was gonna be out the future of that shit like mm -hmm. this. Cause that nigga was, wasn't cussing. Nigga nah. was just making some fire ass music, dog. Mm -hmm. And you could just tell how that nigga look like, like that nigga gonna be a star. Yeah. Like compared to everybody else, you could just pinpoint that shit. I guess Baby knew and shit. <laughs> you know yeah, Baby definitely knew. Yeah, yeah, hell yeah. He knew about all them niggas. When I, when I really got to rap deep, I'll say Lil Wayne for me too, dog. Yeah. Like on some childish shit, nigga, I was like a Hammer fan, nigga. When I was like, Who? Hammer, nigga, MC Hammer. MC Hammer. The first thing. <laughs> okay, for sure then. MC yeah. Hammer then. Okay. I was like, what? Six, nigga, five? Okay, all right. So I'm then. like, dog, like, nigga, I'm talking about MC Hammer cartoon, nigga. Mm. Nigga, he had all them parts, so I told my dad, give me a whole bunch of parts on the side, nigga. Oh, shit, okay. Like, like Hammer was that nigga for well, me. Shout bro. out to Hammer, man. Hammer and motherfucking crisscross, nigga, like. Yeah, okay. Going to school with my shit backwards with the starter jacket, nigga, like, mm -hmm. all that good shit, dog. Shout out to them, because they, they really set the foundation for a lot of young rappers. Hell yeah, for sure, for sure. Mm -hmm. What's some shit, dog, like, growing up, bro? I kind of asked you this shit last time. Some shit I, I came up with not too long ago. Yeah. Some shit that you wanted to do as a young and that you just never told nobody or just never tried. Like, I ain't told niggas, like, I wanted to tap dance when I was a little kid, nigga. Yeah. Like, I'm um, be karate kid in that bitch. Like, shit, I always wanted to act. I just never told also, nobody. Also, that shit always in yeah. I just always, I, I mean, I'm, I'm a... I'm a vain nigga, so yeah. I, I like to see myself everywhere. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so it's like I'm, I want to see myself behind the camera, regardless. Yeah. So yeah, it was, it was always acting. Oh yeah, for sure. Nobody yeah. no nobody knew it though. Nobody at all. Nah. Hell no, nah, dog. Yeah, yeah. That, that acting shit, bro. Like I don't think that should be hard. I, I want to try that shit though. Like I said, nigga, on the last episode. Going one and going two. Yeah, third yeah, one, third. Yeah, yeah, third. <laughs> yeah, nigga, third, nigga, nigga. Nigga, you can get shot in a couple movies. They'll let you get shot Duh, in a movie, nigga. Throw yeah. you a hundred dollars, like get shot in a movie, because that's what niggas. Hey, that's what niggas be on. Yeah, yeah. You be a goon easily out here. Yeah, yeah now, now speaking of the, uh, of the, the movie tip, bro. Like you've yeah. been doing your thing, nigga. Like for sure. Shit, within this year, nigga. Like you've been using that uh, that web series. Uh, what's the name of that shit? Uh, uh -huh. McGraw. No, no, no. The one you did with um old girl, uh Candy uh Oh, uh what's that? What's wrong with it? Was that uh Living a Lie? The other uh, it was a different one, I think. Damn, you've been doing so much shit. Yeah, dude. I'm trying to see what you're talking about. <laughs> it uh, was like the one right around the time, like top of the year you was doing, dog. With Candy uh, Camper Oh, you talking about um It was like you you said you and your uh, yeah, was yeah, you yeah, and your yeah, brother yeah, killing yeah. niggas or some yeah, shit. Yeah, I remember that. That that kinda got pushed back. Yeah, cause I never seen no shit yeah, like Yeah, it, it it definitely got pushed back. I know I know the name of what you're talking about, but yeah. it got pushed back because of uh production though. But okay. shout out to Candy Kane though. She's yeah. still doing her thing. She's shooting another movie now. Oh yeah, for sure, for sure. Yeah, yeah. yeah my nigga been so many things, dog. Nigga yeah, I done forgot dog. about this shit. <laughs> <laughs> my fault, Candy. My one, fault. The one you did like uh, I guess it was like Halloween or a month ago or something like that. Yeah, uh, retribution. Retribution. Nah, yeah, dog. Yeah. You did that shit with uh, producer Q homeboy Marv and shit. Yeah, dog. shout out Marv. My nigga was yeah. really good. Hey, so I'm watching the junk, dog, and I'm like, this
you slap me around, then you cook for me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like, nigga, yeah. I'm here, nigga, rolling, dog. Nigga yeah. say you made me a gourmet meal, nigga. Mm -hmm. Talking about some nigga eat, nigga. And he had the nigga eat like a dog, nigga. Like, nigga, I'm tired up. How am I supposed to eat? You better figure that shit out, nigga. <laughs> you got something on TV, nigga? Nigga, eat like a dog, nigga, dog, for real. But no, yeah. how did uh how did uh how that role come about, dog? It was a short film, I think it was like uh, forty eight minutes, right? Yeah, yeah, it was it was it was a short film and we had a lot much more to put on it, but we had to cut it down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah shout out to Kev, man, him and uh Nita Nita, man, they really did their thing with that, man. You know he did that whole movie by himself. Oh, straight up. And he edited it and put that shit together by himself. So shout out to him on that for real. For yeah, real. Yeah, yeah, he yeah. did his thing. But um it really came about. He reached out to me. Uh mm -hmm. I've been in touch with him for the longest. I've been asking him for work, been asking him for work and um one day he seen me in McGraw and he reached out like I got a role. If you uh, like it, you can come in and audition. Yeah. I auditioned and knocked it out the park and then shit. Mm -hmm. He gave me the script. Mm -hmm. And it was so crazy because I was working on that script. Yeah. And bad girls too at the same time. Okay. Plus I was putting out a a, a mixtape. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They so, working, man. Yeah. <laughs> so it was like what twenty five pages, and I got that shit down to the T. We did it in about two months, though. Oh, straight up. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, not 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 to tell the whole thing. I, I know you still want people to see it and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. But you know, what I'm saying basically, you encounter you break to somebody's house and shit. You want some answers and junk like that, dog. Yeah. You know yeah. what I'm saying? So it's like that's when Marv come in and shit. Like without giving it away here. He like uh, somebody from your past and shit. Yeah, yeah, I, I could say a little bit about it. Yeah, so um, he like a stepdad. Yeah, it was. You got answers for it. Yeah, my stepdad that uh pretty much abused me as a child, mm -hmm. and I uh, come back around and I pretty much torture him and yeah, just try yeah. to make just try to make him uh understand who I am and why I'm doing the stuff I'm doing to him. For sure. Like y'all remember a movie called Misery? Oh uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. Some, somewhat. Yeah. So it was supposed to be like somewhat like a misery just with mm. a, a a different twist to it. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Now what's yeah. what what uh, what's some what's some stepdad rules, dog? Like could you be a stepdad nigga? I have. <laughs> <laughs> step <laughs> hey, stepdaddy self. Like I done had <laughs> hey, shout out to my kids, man. They still my, my kids, man. Mm -hmm. But uh what's, yeah, what's I, some I stepdad definitely. rules if they got after uh, a, a active real dad. What's some stepdad rules? Cause my son has a stepmom and a stepdad. His mom is yeah. married and then I'm married. So like what's some yeah. I know some stepdad rules, but what's, what's some of your, what's some stepdad rules as the person that will play a stepdad? You 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 can't beat the kid. Yeah. You can discipline the child, but you can't put your hands on the kid. For sure, no. You know facts. what I'm saying? Yes, say that that's that's number one. Yeah. Um, uh, you can't be talking about the baby father neither. Yeah. No. You know no, what I'm saying? Like yeah. I, it don't matter if if the baby uh, it doesn't matter if your significant other the woman is saying she don't like her baby father, you ain't got no right to say, yeah, he a whole ass nigga. Yeah, like, yeah, you yeah. leave that to them. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so, fight that shit out. You know what I'm saying? You don't, you don't speak on that. That yeah, has nothing to do with you. You know what I'm saying? So, <laughs> <laughs> so, I, I ain't never spoke down on none of my, you know, my females, baby fathers. It's yeah. just, oh, I, and, and, I do this like I I told my girl at the time I want to meet the, the nigga oh, the I was facts. I was yeah. taking my baby girl to school yeah. so I need to meet him and let him know I'm gonna be doing this yeah for sure you know that's saying? a real nigga though yeah that's so, real nigga shit yeah. yeah so yeah you just gotta just it, like I said it's gotta be a balance with all that stuff yeah, yeah. now you say like no no putting hands on them you can discipline without putting hands on them but mm -hmm. what if the dad's like just passed away and then like y'all deep like y'all years in that shit and he look at you as like a father figure do you still go by those rules uh well di well discipline them of, of course but I had a girl you know what mm -hmm. I'm saying so I wouldn't beat on my baby girl no mm -hmm. way you know what I'm saying so uh but I had a boy too yeah, <laughs> still my boy, but no, I uh definitely discipline. I could definitely say that. Uh, but yeah. with the boy is a little bit different though. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. got to make sure he tough and For just sure. rough. For sure, not not, not being stepdad self. Yeah, like what up, dog, like when you, <laughs> when you when you uh say if you ain't got got real close with the kids, but then you and the mom not working out, do you still keep that <sighs> connection like with the kids? Like, dog, how you doing? It great, straight. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, I definitely am. Yeah, uh, for my uh. A little boy, I'm definitely gonna keep reaching out to him and reaching out to her yeah, definitely yeah. because I've been around for a long time and he know who I am. Yeah, for sure. So I'm always gonna reach out to her and make sure that he good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So hell yeah, yeah. That, that's just that's that's besides step daddy rules. That's just real nigga rules. No, for sure, facts. Yeah. Hell yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. But it's rules that shit. And what you said, that's important, bro. Cause mm -hmm. like when me and my son, and mom had broke up, dog, and she had got with somebody. I'm like, bro, like when you gonna introduce me? Right. I'm like, cause my son, he was staying with me, but he was still going with her for like weekends, so he's still around him. So nigga, I just one day I just went out there, nigga, like, dog, what up? I'm, I'm mm -hmm. shy. This day and the third, mm -hmm. and shit, they still together, like, like shit. I'm like, I'm thank God she got her like a, a dude who kind of like you know what I'm saying, yeah, kind of yeah. square a little bit, ain't, right, too, ain't trying right. to be no thug out here, nigga, trying to tell my son knock his fort over and shit, dog. Oh yeah, oh you know what? I was never one. 
<laughs> Knock the little nigga pillows over his shit. Now, dog, have you ever have you ever seen a situation, dog, like or know somebody, family or somebody, like they've been in a situation where like the stepdad beating on the kids or doing things to the kids, but the the mom not believing the kids because she's so in love with this nigga, dog. Uh, well, shit, nobody really personally, you know yeah. what I'm saying. But I do hear about that shit, yeah, yeah, yeah. you know what I'm saying. That but, shit you be know, fucked up. Yeah, it is, and you know, like me, I always want to give my no, I don't want to put my two cents in everything. Mm -hmm. I just tell no, them what sure. I would do if that was my situation, though. Yeah. But nah, nobody I really knew went through that for real. Yeah, nah, dog. In this movie, dog, my nigga said got his crown, dog. <laughs> nigga left out crying, dog. Yo, man, that's crazy. I'm like, this is some embarrassing shit. That was so embarrassing. Now, was that real tear? You got some water or some shit, dog? Like, no, nah, nigga, I was a real, I was a real tear. Hey, ask some more what happened, how that shit happened. We it was some funny shit we had to do to get that shit. You like, nigga, think about something that's gonna make you cry. Mm -hmm. So Marv, so damn silly, bro. We in there laughing, bro, and yeah. nigga said some shit, and we had an idea. It was an onion. Yeah, <laughs> he like just chop up the onion yeah, yeah, yeah. or squeeze the onion. So I'm just squeezing the onion like nigga. I'm trying to get a tear to come out this motherfucker. Duh. So when the one little tear came out, then they like, like shoot, shoot. You know what I'm saying? That nigga had that motherfucker going too. Like, yeah, nigga. that was some real shit though. I did my thing on that part though. I yeah. forgot about that one though. Oh yeah, one nigga said guy is bad. Nigga like nigga got range. Nigga like ah yeah. Nigga I'm gonna cry. I'm whoop a little ass. <laughs> Stab a nigga. Yeah, that nigga say, say that nigga say what that nigga say. First the first thing he said was like nigga. Question number one: When you become a bitch ass? Nigga. <laughs> <laughs> no, how nigga? I might as well like, duh, that shit funny as hell, dog. Mm -hmm. Shout out to my motherfucking Marv and shit, dog. Yeah, shout out to Marv and Kev, man. Neither two, man. Everybody was a part of that, man. That was that was a real you one. Nigga, hold on, dog. So you've been doing this, these movies and shit, dog. Little series and shit here and there, like. Mm -hmm. When you gonna when you gonna write your your own shit, bro? Shit, I know and it's that, coming. And I, I'm so glad you said that, man, because I'm I'm linking up with uh the nigga that shot um Retribution. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm pretty much like the co-producer of Little House Films right about now. Mm -hmm. So uh, I got a project in hand. Mm -hmm. I mean, in my, me and my mans, we've been coming up with some uh, scenes and stuff. Mm -hmm. And we just coming up with the right time to shoot it, you know, through, through the weather and all that shit. Cause I don't really play with the COVID shit. <laughs> yeah, I ain't yeah, gonna yeah, lie, I'm just sure. trying to, no, I don't wanna get involved in that. But <laughs> we got we got some coming and some is definitely, is, is definitely on the way. For sure. Definitely on the way. Hell yeah, dog. Like mm -hmm. I said, man, if y'all need a scene when the niggas need to shoot the studio podcast niggas up, Oh yeah, for sure, man. See, Just holler at me, we man. Right here, we could be out like we interviewing niggas. Y'all come to bitches, pop me and kill Pop the niggas. <laughs> like, you niggas get shot, man. Nigga gonna, <laughs> nigga gonna be on social media get popped on motherfucker. Uh, dog, that shit funny as hell, dog. Not good with nigga. I, I never want to get popped. This shit, dog. <laughs> I don't get popped, man. Hell, I don't yeah. get popped, bro. All right, I don't get popped. I'm gonna be a thug and shit, dog. That's all, nigga. Real quick, nigga. Hey, put that shit down, nigga. Give me that shit. That's all I want to say. Nigga. Run that shit. Yeah. That's it, dog. <laughs> Now uh, right. I see uh, uh bad girls too. Yeah, but, yeah. Uh, give us a little bit about that shit, bro. Like, what's that? What's that about? And, uh, what you what you play in this role? Oh well, shit, yeah. Uh, you never seen Bad Girls one? No. Okay, nope, well yeah. Nope. So, dang, you gotta see Bad Girls. I gotta get oh, him. Though. Man, you, would you in that? No, I wouldn't. Okay, okay, okay. I won okay, okay, I that one. But uh, just to know, it's a, it's about four. Uh, I ain't gonna say bad bees, but four beautiful females. Okay. They uh robbing banks, robbing strip clubs, hitting licks on people and shit. Mm. And yeah, I think I did see it first. Yeah, and uh yeah. So uh, and uh I I play like um the nigga that was setting up the licks for him. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, me and uh, LA Love Boss. Uh, shout out to her. I was setting the licks up yeah. and I tell her and she'll tell her girls or whatever okay. and they go get down on the nigga and all like that. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, so you yeah, got yeah. That, you you got a, uh, like a, a role that's like Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was it was a, a really good role. Shout out to Will and Howard, man, and the whole production crew, man. They really show love, man, for mm -hmm. real. Now I know you like like I said, dog, you've been deep in your in your acting bed, bro. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So uh how do you prepare for a role, bro? Like what makes you decide like by reading when you read the script like if I'm gonna take this shit or not Ooh, that's a good ass question cause you know. I just got hit with another role yeah. I'm thinking about if I'm gonna take it or not mm -hmm. but this is what I was thinking like I would want my family to come see a movie to where I'm not getting slain or shot in the face or I'm doing some shit that they won't be proud of yeah, for sure. and you gotta really have that you know that courage to say okay i'm on the screen and everybody got to start somewhere no for sure, you know, for sure. Some niggas gonna get shot niggas gonna get beat up some mm -hmm. niggas might be an extra for a couple seconds though but as long as they ain't degrading my character mm -hmm. as in my everyday life then i'm pretty much can play the role for sure to be honest though oh, so yeah. i'm gonna just say that then. yeah yeah now, nigga, now you got uh like i said i already talked shit about nigga, how you got a line about which i had shit with the hair and shit <laughs> <laughs> well, but, well you know this is a dream role nigga denzel hit you up like say i've been watching your production your work and shit no. I want you for this role, but the role, nigga, I have a fucking haircut, darling. Uh, what, for Denzel? Yeah. 
You got to chop that shit off, though. Hell yeah, I'm chopping <laughs> that shit off, nigga. <laughs> hey, listen, I can grow hair back. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I can't get a shot with Denzel like that, yeah, nigga. Yeah. Come on now, nigga. And you know what's really fucked up? I was just telling my mans this. Nigga sent me a script for the BMF. Yeah. Nigga sent me a script for BMF. For sure. Like a year ago, and I'm thinking like this shit fake. I don't know. My dumb ass was like, man, this shit can't be real. This shit can't be real. This yeah. shit can't be real. Yeah. And the shit was fucking real. Damn. I ain't never get back to the motherfuckers that sent me the motherfucking shit. Damn. Never got back to them sent the shit. And so, this is this is real life shit. I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm coming from buying a jacket. I just came from a motherfucking photo shoot. A nigga hit my phone. I did not know the number, so I ain't answer it. Mm -hmm. They sent a link. To my for my personal number, mm -hmm. and it was the BMF script. Like you audition for these yeah. people, and they was in the first season of BMF. Damn, the same motherfucking people. I said, "Ain't this a bitch?" <laughs> Dog, I was hurt. Hell, hell yeah, I bet. I hurt, nigga. I was hurt. I had told my man, it's "Like we gonna do this, we gonna do this." He like, man, they already shooting that shit. I'm like, man, fuck that shit. I'm finna do this shit. Yeah. Fucking around, got caught up in some other shit and just let that shit by, uh, bypass, man. And Damn. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie to that shit fucked me up. Was it shit that you saw it was too late or you just like didn't get around to it? Around to um, it I didn't get around to it in time. Again, but you already thought it was fake and shit. Yeah, I would, cause, because it'd be a lot of scamming niggas. Oh, hell yeah, hell yeah, I ain't yeah. put my information on just anything that you send me through the internet. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? That's how niggas get you know fucked up for real. So mm -hmm. I was doing some research on it. And by that time I went back to find the fucking link, it was gone. Damn. So I just that was a big L I, I lost though. I really, really, really would have been on BMF the first season. Real Man. real fucking rap. Well shit, you got uh you got another chance, bro, cause uh old girl who was on there on our show, dog. Uh uh Mar 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 Marissa. Marissa mm. Damn, I always forget her name. Marissa, okay. She um when she was on the show, bro, she was talking about that shit cause she from E Course. Yeah. And she was saying she wish she could have got on the show. And on the part, I tagged nigga uh, Southwest nigga T on that bitch. Mm -hmm. Nigga hit her up. Yeah. Nigga hit her up. Nigga said we gonna be doing casting, uh, in February. Mm -hmm. Like they gonna be doing auditions in February, shit. So. Oh shit. Man. Oh shit. For season, for season two, <laughs> nigga, they about to start doing that shit. All right, all right. You ain't said shit then. Yeah, so nigga, shit. On, then. We get two people on the show on that bitch, nigga. And then, yeah. I'm your man. <laughs> I'm in that bitch, nigga. I'll be in that bitch with a side of meat, like nigga. Hey, Run I'm that shit, cuz. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I look at nigga shout that's to me and shit, cuz. <laughs> that'd be motherfucker. That'd be dope as hell. Yeah, it would. Now back to shit you wouldn't take, bro. Like, we was talking about this shit though. Old girl said like she wouldn't show her body off if she, you know what I'm saying, starting off because she, she ain't getting paid enough. Yeah. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Not um I ain't about to ask you that, but, <laughs> but, but yeah, like, yeah, yeah. But I'm no, saying like, like, like it's roles like like if niggas niggas always want to throw that gay role in on yeah. every motherfucking show. Yeah, and I know you nigga. You like nigga. I'm good. Nah, I ain't, I ain't, I ain't <laughs> Cause all, it's like every show I watch, bro. When it come to power, it come to anything. They, it's yeah, like they yeah. got. It's like it's a must. Like they be like, we gotta incorporate this some type of way. Yeah. And like we know we know it's there, bro. Yeah, it is. It's there, like nigga. And ain't nothing wrong with what you what you do. That's what you do. Mm -hmm. But it's like, it seems like every show is like they got. Put that shit in, bro. The shit is so they so powerful now. They can shut down the whole fucking network. Man, like if a gay motherfucker say, "Oh, you see what they did to uh, Dave Chappelle?" Mm -hmm. You see, nigga, he go hard on the gay community. Yeah. They shut the nigga down and try to cancel the nigga. Y'all try to, but luckily he got so much shit, so much motherfucking clout and so yeah, much so power much over rank. there. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. that they ain't do it, dog. But yeah, man, that shit, that shit, yeah, that shit yeah. tough, dog. Yeah, I, I I wouldn't do no 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 gay roles. I'm not wearing no dress. I'm not doing no gay roles. I'm. I, I wouldn't even play a motherfucking snitch. Yeah. I, ain't, I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. Well, I'm, I'm lying. I'll probably play. I'll probably I'm saying, play. Yeah, yeah, I'll, yeah, probably, yeah. I'll probably play. I'm tripping. Think about that shit. Like, I'm about to say you tripping, dog. I'll, 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 I'll play. I'll play. I'll play a snitch. Oh, be whatever. They be like, we need you to be one of the niggas who snitched on me. All right, nigga. Shit. <laughs> yeah, I'm snitching to. on me, then, nigga. Hell nah, yeah. I'm gonna fuck with you. I, <laughs> <laughs> I had to look at you like, hold on, bro. Hold on, bro. hold on. Hold on. Yeah, that shit so, wild, dog. What's some shit though? Like, as far as like with the acting shit, dog. Like on some short term shit, man. That you wanna, you know, saying conquer or motherfucking, you know, saying achievement shit, bro. Like for uh, real, or some shit. Pretty like. much just learn how to work the camera, like with with the editing and mm -hmm. everything, and just know what everything is. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Just learn everything is as as far as the acting and, and like the cameras and the roles and what it means to really speak and get better. You mm -hmm, know for what I'm sure. saying? It's always room for improvement. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. Now, do you want the roles that's like outside the city? Like you do a big movie and you just like you know what I'm saying Cali with it, or you 
You you and went down to Atlanta for a month to shoot a movie like you mm-hmm. trying to do that shit so you can oh yeah you know yeah. what I'm saying get out that that, that Detroit scene quote yeah unquote. yeah because that's the only way you gonna really go you really gonna grow like that. Mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying but not to mention you got niggas from out of town coming here to shoot movies for sure you for know sure. the nigga from uh Black Ink Crew mm-hmm. the nigga dying okay yeah, yeah, yeah he yeah. just did um a movie here called Paper. Uh, I think it's called Paper Notes or Paper something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I apologize, Dennis Reed, for not knowing it, but uh, yeah. he just did he just did a movie and it just premiered in the uh, in the in the theaters on on Eight Mile at the Phoenix or whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So they coming from out of town just to do movies. Oh yeah, here. for sure, fucking with us and shit, dog. Mm-hmm. There be a lot of people down here. You had yeah. uh, Hoops. AJ Johnson was down here doing some shit, yeah, dog. Hoops. Like yeah, yeah, rest in peace, AJ Johnson and shit. Yeah. Hoops and shit, dog. Mm-hmm. You had uh, Jim Jones that played a quick cameo in that one little Detroit movie shit. Uh, first, first lady. Yep, yep. Yeah. Hoops and shit. Mm-hmm. Then you had my man who um who played in um damn I forget I forget his name. Uh, fuck dog. The dude who was in um stump the yard and shit dog. Columbus Short. Yeah, Columbus Short. Yeah. Like niggas coming down here fucking with us, bro. Yeah, niggas fucking with us. Niggas fucking with Detroit and it just like nigga. We in on hole, fire. Man. We on fire right now. With everything, dog. For yeah. real, for real. What about some uh like some some stage plays and shit, bro? You into nah, that? Nah. Well, I haven't did that, but I know that's what Marv said he did. Mm-hmm. And uh, I don't got a problem with speaking in front of people though, so I'm down for whatever though. Yeah. I'll do that though. Hell yeah, for sure. Hell yeah, nigga. Mm-hmm. Shit, get my nigga seven everything, dog. Mm-hmm. Nigga trying to nigga twenty twenty. Too and they get everything, dog. It's my year, it's my year. Hell yeah. Now, shit, man, get on the music shit, dog. Uh, the past, dog. Mm-hmm. Pandemic ain't stopping shit. Ooh, yes. You released that April 7th, dog. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm yeah. saying? What was, what was the response to that, dog? Um, and do you feel like, nigga, like, with the music, what was the response to that first and second? Do you feel like you get the love that you deserve as far as, like, on the music, too? Well, shit, I'm gonna be real honest with you, man. As far as the past, I always put out a tape every year mm-hmm. and the people I fuck with really fuck with my music for real mm-hmm. but it's just me being such an introvert for real I don't want to go out and do shows COVID got me in, in, in the crib yeah, yeah. and then it's like regardless man I don't want to live my life chasing the dream I'm trying to get the paper I'm yeah. going to make sure the bag steady first I'm sure. always have some fucking money yeah, yeah, so I can yeah. p- pursue this motherfucking dream mm-hmm. so pretty much it's, it's, it's like you know I'm into the music right about now but it's like the, the movies is paying more and it's paying quicker yeah, yeah, so I'm sure, always yeah. going to rap like I'm finna drive this tape now just to let people know what's really going on mm-hmm. but you know i feel like if i just push myself a little bit harder and find and found some more mm-hmm. marketing and practice on my promotion mm-hmm. i'll be i'll be up out of here because yeah. my people in cali love me yeah, you know yeah, what i'm saying yeah, yeah. They, they, they they definitely showing they definitely showing me love but now i get what you're saying though dog as far as like when you seeing some shit that you do and the, and the money coming in you like shit this after shit nigga fuck this is where like that. i said you like we talked about it then you've been in different shit mm-hmm. like you've been steady moving with this shit so it's like damn do i put my do I do, do I do the music shit for real or do I do it like it can become a hobby for you because you so busy getting money from this, this mm-hmm. actor shit? Yeah, yeah. Now, do you know like I say you drop that shit and you already know we always do like a top three off of that motherfucker, dog. Mm-hmm. It's seven tracks on there. My top three, dog, is uh, Liquor uh, liquor Run. Oh, yeah. Uh, uh, Bend a Minute. Oh, yeah. And then last, I'm going to do that shit just because you have my people in that motherfucker and it's like some shit for the women, dog. That's, uh, <laughs> that's sometimes, dog. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Shout out yeah. Diamond again. Shout um, out, <laughs> hey, keep shouting her out, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit, dog. Yeah. So what will be your three, bro? Uh, I'm going to definitely say Ben a Minute, Sometimes, and oh, ban- and Bands on me. Shout out to uh, Rocky Bad, too. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Like, was that some shit you just, like, hear up in the DM or some shit? Or? Yeah, I hear up in DM and just, you yeah. know, we worked out the, the, the details and all. Yeah. And she was a real cool chick, man. Oh, yeah, Rocky, really, dog. Man. You had said when. Like, come on the show. Yeah, I, man, she didn't come up here. I hit her up, dog, her. and she like, when you want, when you want me to come? I'm like, dog, shit, she still ain't got, she still man, ain't ready. Hit her back, <laughs> <laughs> come now. <laughs> <laughs> For sure, For nigga, real. I need that, I need that love, dog. Next year, I'm trying to make sure we do some big things. Yeah, you gonna get her on the show, nigga? It's gonna go crazy. Oh, no, I'm already knowing, dog. Cause uh-huh. shit, that motherfucker, yeah, she, 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 uh, she doing her thing, dog. Oh, she definitely, she is. doing her thing for sure. She definitely is. Now, uh, you already know we do this shit. Talk about the bars, man, from the past and shit, dog. We gonna uh. So a little shit that you said, nigga. We gonna talk about it, dog. Okay, for sure. On some funny shit, nigga. On that uh, song, patience. You say I never trust a bitch. Blame Jay Pickett. <laughs> <laughs> and we just talk about that shit on the, on the show. I did. Shout out to Cheese and my homegirl Chase West, dog. Yeah. Like, nigga, you can't handle no motherfucker. Like, we used to, what, what we say? I say, oh yeah. I had asked my uh, homegirl and my dog, like, nigga, like, you with a chick, you with her and shit, but she was in a, a relationship prior, and he passed away. Do, can she like say something on Facebook like recipes such and such? Cause she show Tupac love every year. I'll be like, all right though. I got enough for Tupac. Uh-huh, you ain't about to keep yeah. showing this nigga love every birthday. We get it, nigga. Y'all was some homies. Like, would you would you get offended by that? Hell yeah. If it, if, if if it was Pac though. <laughs> 
Yeah. <laughs> I'm saying it's, 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 oh, it's yeah. Tupac. Oh, you know yeah, you're right, you're right. You're, it's, it's, it's Pac, If it was though. Craig, nigga, I'm like, nigga, fuck that, nigga. Fuck Craig. <laughs> <laughs> nah, it, it was, it's only because of who it was, though. Mm-hmm. You know, you, you went to school with Tupac, y'all acting with each other. <laughs> yeah. You know what I'm saying? She just showing love for a friend because the dead, you got to respect the dead. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah. They ain't here no more. You are, you already winning. Regardless, if a man hate on the dead man, you ain't no real man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you right though about the Tupac shit though. It's yeah, Tupac. Yeah. It's Tupac. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so I wouldn't I trip though. Now, if y'all was just some regular, like if Jay Pickett and Will Smith and Tupac were just some regular niggas, Craig, motherfucking nigga, uh, uh, Sam and fucking Felicia. Yeah, I like, nah, you still thinking about this thing? <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, yeah. I, mean, I, I feel some type of way. I ain't gonna lie, but hey. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, you go. I'll give you one stat and shit one year, though. You good. Like, Man, just because what Jada Pickett did was foul. No, hell yeah. That was foul. And then y'all talk about, uh, well, not gonna say y'all, but just the media in general. Like, you know, you made it seem Will and Jada was just a perfect example. Exactly. Like, a relationship goals. Yeah, yeah. Now. The entanglement between her and August was crazy, and then nigga made a song about Man. it. It's like that ultimate disrespect, Will. Like Jesus Christ, and you seen them on that motherfucking uh, Fresh Prince of Bel Air reunion. Mm -hmm. He looked so motherfucking stressed, like Duh. he was going through so much. You ain't never seen Uncle Will like. <laughs> that. Nigga, Will was looking bad. I'm like, man, see that's that's what a woman can can do to you. A woman man. will fuck your whole man. Dangerous, nigga. Dangerous, nigga. Dangerous, nigga. <laughs> Because nigga like you nigga you talking about knocking you out your motherfucking place dog Man I'm telling you dude Nigga like nigga me and my wife nigga we get to it nigga be like nigga just like nigga it fucking be a whole shit cause you know that shit ain't right Yeah and you going to work nigga like a girl got power bro a female got power I ain't gonna say girls cause we grown a female woman got power dog it can it can she can hurt you without hurting you, bro. Man. Ain't got to say a word. And I think that's probably the worst shit when they ain't saying two, shit. Man, two two things my brother told me. A woman got two things. Her mouth and her pussy. Oh, shit. Hell they yeah. They powerful. Nigga. You don't underestimate <laughs> those two. The pussy going to make you do some crazy shit. No, for sure. If a woman, a woman can talk to you and break you the fuck down. Man, hell yeah. She ain't got to put her, because she can't fuck with you physically. Mm-hmm. But. Mentally, and she going to have you. Oh, yeah. You said nigga. You hit And that that's why I tell my son, bro. Females gonna always be here Cause he he just turned 15 Got his first little girlfriend shit mm -hmm. Borrowed little gifts He bought him Give him a listen bro Like this all cool It's all good I went through the same shit mm -hmm. You get your little girlfriend Nigga you in love and shit dog you, yeah. you don't know what to do with yourself But I'm like bro Trust me when I say this Focus on that school And that hooping Because girls gonna always be there Pussy gonna be there They gonna, It's gonna always be there And it, it's gonna always give you problems Boy mm -hmm. you gonna always try to Find a way to <laughs> Make it right Or get it Or Make her happy or make you know what I'm saying? It's yeah. always because everything we do, bro, at the end of the day, it's for females. Yeah, it is. You know what I'm saying? Wow, so you, you taking me back. <laughs> See, this is the type of shit you got instilling your son. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? You gotta let let them know early. For sure. I'll be telling my dog, don't be a goofy, don't be saying your piece. Don't mm -hmm. because don't be saying some, some goofy shit that you don't want to be shared. Cause if you say wrong shit, she gonna screenshot that shit and, and whenever y'all get into it. It's gonna be shown. Man, I'm so glad you said that. Nigga. The screenshots. Everybody <laughs> listen to this, all right? Duh. I got an iPhone. I don't I don't text. Mm -hmm. I voice, I voice chat. <laughs> you can't read what I'm saying. After the voice chat is gone, it's gone. It, it deletes. Yeah. You can't <laughs> screenshot shit I'm motherfucking yeah. saying. You know what I'm saying? My my chick was checking my cash app yeah. to see what chicks I was Damn. sending money. Nigga, yeah. last nigga, yeah. it get real, it got Duh. real with me, nigga. Yeah. Like it was serious. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry, Duh. man. I'm sorry. <laughs> She had nerve, nigga. Like, dog. I'm, sorry, I'm glad you tell little nigga that shit, dog. Cause you just gotta instill that shit in them while they're young, mm -hmm. man. So yeah, but now nah, these these women are definitely dangerous, though. No, for I ain't sure. Gonna lie. That's a fast dog. That's a fast mm -hmm. dog. <laughs> now, uh, staying on a woman, dog. You on, on a what's name? On sometimes you say you a home buyer, so I know you hate the streets. Sometimes that's the perfect woman for you, bro. Oh yeah. You don't want nobody who got some. Yeah, some receipts on her ass, dog. Longest yeah, fucking EBT yeah. and shit. <laughs> you feel me? Like I was always been that type. Like, like the woman I was uh di I was dealing with recently. Um, she ain't really post on Facebook like, like that. She wasn't really that type to be outside. She mm -hmm. own her own house, so that's where you gonna be at for sure. But when it's time to pop out, she gonna pop, pop out. out the right way. Yeah, she yeah, gonna yeah. go to work. She gonna come home and take care of home. Mm -hmm. Cause when you grown, you know what the streets offer. The streets yeah. ain't got a love for nobody. Hell yeah, for sure. So you can't get caught up in that cycle. How what about you? you? You in a relationship with a chick, dog? Do you be like, like if, if certain certain homies of hers, like like some, you know what I'm saying, for lack of a better word, some hood rats. Yeah. You cool with her, like, like, like you be like, damn, are you th second guessing, like, damn, she going out with them? I know what they about. 
Or you like, or you like, I know my girl, I know nigga, whatever they do, she's still gonna do her shit, like, I as a mean, woman. Well, you, you, you are you familiar with the term birds of a feather? Oh, yeah, yeah, for sure. Um, you know what? I'm gonna say this that ain't always true, though. Yeah, because my man's had a damn girlfriend when he go out with us, that nigga. Get his drink set to the side. Mm -hmm. uh, talk to his girl. Text his girl. He'll mm -hmm. ride with her to the liquor store, but when his girl call, he don't. I think I'm, I think I fall in that category a little bit. <laughs> yeah, good, good shit. <laughs> good, good shit. For real, good nigga. Shit, like, so I good. swear, I be on chill, bro. Yeah, yeah. And, and like the thing about it, my wife is a fucking preschool teacher. Right. So she got all the young mothers who come in there that Ooh. know me who I don't know. Mm -hmm. So if I was were to get in that junk, I'm. I'm 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 getting to a messy game right now. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Cause that, Detroit is small. It is. Everybody know everybody. Like yeah. nigga, that's why I, whenever I, when I used to do my dirt, bro, I mean I used to check mutual friends on Facebook though. You make got sure. to. Oh yeah. You <laughs> Just to make sure like, yeah. like, oh yeah, I can't fuck her. Nah, she know this yeah. person. Nah, <laughs> she fuck her cousin. Oh hell no. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, definitely. <laughs> Duh. Now uh, this this is funny, dog. So I, I um, <laughs> um you say uh. Uh, say you got a man where I'm trying I'm trying to be your friend though. What's your record on that? As far as like nigga, that shit really working. That that line, nigga, like uh, when shit. girl say I got a man, but it be like, nigga shit, I'm just trying to be a homie. You know what I'm saying? Because what's your record, dog? Is it is it I mean what, what you mean record like? Like is it good record, <laughs> nigga, bad record? I, 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 I mean, I, like I'm just trying to be a man. Like on some real shit, like, you know, because I say it like this. You gotta build a strong bond mm -hmm. before you get in a relationship. Mm -hmm. Like the title isn't everything. No, for sure. You gotta have that strong bond for mm -hmm. strong bond first part of me. Yeah. So if you build a strong bond and a good foundation, you gonna be good. So mm -hmm. we ain't gotta have no title for what we really doing. You no, know? yeah. and it's like now nah, I'm now nah, I'm mm -hmm. your man. They got shit to talk about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Instead of me just being a homie, what y'all gonna say? Besides y'all think that we fucking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Y'all ain't got nothing to say about what we got going on. Sometimes you gotta keep the peace. Man. Keep keep that shit. It's not a secret. It's just not none of y'all motherfucking business. Mm -hmm. And I'ma say this too. Social media has <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I'm in this shit. I'ma I'm say this shit. <laughs> It just seems like social media now makes it seem like since everything is so public on the internet that people have to let people know what they doing. Yeah, yeah for sure. For you don't me. have to know what I'm doing. No, for sure. You know what I'm for saying? Sure. I can keep some shit private because it's not none of your business. Yeah, yeah. Because when it becomes your business, then it becomes gossip. Mm -hmm. Then when it becomes gossip, it becomes drama. Mm -hmm. Then when it becomes drama, it's a situ, it's a it's messy it. situation. Hell yeah, for real, for real. You know what I'm saying? So to keep yourself away from that shit, just keep your moves quiet. Yeah, and I, I know it's like on your IG, dog, you don't be... You don't post too much bullshit, dog. It's about working, what you doing. All day. It's you know been what I'm that saying? way. Yeah. Only time I get mad when you post motherfucking your hair braids. Shit. I'm like, dang. Man, my braids <laughs> is the truth. What hey, a She the truth with it. No, you know no, no. She be having some cold shit. Got, I even clicked on her page. Like, damn. Yeah, she, she, she fire. Hell yeah, nigga. Because uh, I ain't going to tell a person uh name and shit, dog. But this motherfucker uh, on Black Friday, nigga, they had a deal on like, the little hair shit. You put your shit to get your shit back right. You probably know what I'm talking about, too. That nigga spent, then he got the half off boy. You gotta take a pill and you gotta put like this little scrub and shit in your hair. A pill? It's a <laughs> well, I ain't no fucking pill, cuz. <laughs> it's a goofy. You go through that shit to get your hair long, nigga. <laughs> no, it's, get, it's like to get the spots that's like, like start to thin out. Okay, Plus, yeah. supposed to get that bitch thick and shit. Okay, all right. So, I might like, nigga, let me know if that shit work. <laughs> man, okay, okay, you is this different, man. No, I ain't gonna do that shit. Now, I'm good. I got a wife now, so I don't give a fuck. If I was single, then I'd probably be like, let me go ahead and try this hair and shit. Nah, hey, it's like the hair, like women like hair. Yeah. But it's like it's really like beards though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like yeah, keep yeah. your beard together. Female yeah. gonna love that shit. Yeah, and then end of the day, bro, it's just like it's about you, dog. Like niggas be thinking like they need a certain thing. It's, it's you. What you mm -hmm. gonna you gonna keep yourself right, keep yourself good. Right. You know what I'm saying you can get any, any you can get any chick you want for real. If you yeah. just shit know how you move. Be yourself. Yeah, for sure. Be yourself. For sure, nigga. Don't wear no hair don't wear no hair pieces, y'all, nigga. Fuck that. <laughs> ain't that serious. It ain't ever that serious, dog. Uh, Fuck that, nigga. Nigga, <laughs> nigga that bitch going barbershop, nigga, looking like well fuck it. Uncle Phil, come on, uh, that bitch looking like Fresh Prince. Like, I'm damn. I'm telling you, nigga, it's niggas out here that really want that that type of hair. Now on liquor run, dog, you say yeah. Say I'ma wake wake her wake her babies up. I'm like, fuck them kids. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, I knew it was like the <laughs> <laughs> I, only thing I thought about baby boy, dog. Classic, man. Yeah, now I know classic. from talking to you, you ain't that type of nigga. They're just a hot line and shit. Dog. Yeah, yeah, no, I, I ain't gonna say fuck no off nobody kids like that, man. <laughs> I wake her babies up. Ain't that one for eating snacks and shit, dog. Eating the lunchables, oh. dog. <laughs> 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 shit, fuck as hell, dog. Now, nah, uh, nah. Uh, uh, also on liquor run, dog. You had me think about my whole my old uh, club days, dog. You said can't take the, can't talk that club shit to me. I did it, bro. Fuck buying the bar, I buy the liquor stuff. Yeah, fuck around buy the liquor stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Facts, so, so nigga, that shit, that shit take me to my club days, dog. Just yeah. like, 
We was buying the bars early because still buying. But nigga, like, dog, them club days, I just remember, dog, pre gaming on the way to St. Andrews, bro, mm-hmm. or Plan B. And nigga, like, just getting some nigga, get drunk as hell on the way, get a little orange juice, mm-hmm. drink that bitch up to like that much, and then fill that bitch up with some motherfucking vodka. Oh, nigga. so you'll fill the bottle up with yeah. Oh, yeah. Shout out to my niggas. We've been doing that, oh. though. Because we ain't ride with no open bottles in the motherfucking car. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Shout Beat out that to bitch, my niggas. Nigga, get whatever yeah. you gonna mix, nigga. Drink mm-hmm. that bitch down, nigga. Mm-hmm. Nigga, and I remember, like, you tell me yours, dog. The first, like, liquor you remember, dog, getting fucked up off of. But mine was the Seagram Gin. Oh, it had to be the eighteen hundred. Oh shit, eighteen hundred with with the little uh shot, yep, little top yep. on it. Man, That's what I'm wondering, like, bro, that that shit was crazy, bro. They used to bring that shit back, the the, the shot bottle, the yeah. little shot. But you know back. now they got it, so it's just a twist on um, cap, like the regular liquor, because they say it was some glass inside that shot. Yeah. And somebody got fucked up from it. Mm, yeah. So I guess that was a lawsuit, so he had to get that bitch off. Smart though. Yeah. That's smart. Yeah, because I remember, nigga, last time I drove some eighteen hundred, I didn't know niggas still drink eighteen hundred. So this is crazy shit though my, yeah. I tell you my, Me and my son mom Ain't been together in years We both married Right I go drop my son off to her She at her stepdad house Nigga stepdad like dog Drink with us Yeah I'm like Alright Nigga that's how I know Nigga me and my wife over here Kicking it with my ex And her, her step family Nigga getting drunk as hell Mm. I'm like, damn, that shit crazy, bro. Mm. Like, but we was vibing, nigga. Yeah, like, the liquor bring that shit out. We was vibing, nigga. The liquor like, bring that shit out, nigga. I, 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 I say I'm gonna have a couple shots when that shit, nigga. Took three hours, nigga. We was in that bitch get drunk. Yeah, we went yeah. back to the store and got some yeah, more. Like, yeah. I'm like, I'm hanging with my fucking this, ex. This nigga cool as hell. No, like, <laughs> like, bro, like this shit this was crazy. Cool. Kind of cool. This nigga, kind of alright. You think you alright, nigga? But then the stepdad, um, her her stepdad was like, yeah. Y'all come over anytime. I'm like, no, we can't get that cool. Mm-hmm. Like, <laughs> but shit, you you would think that that would be uh, good for like the kids growing. No, up, no, right? for sure, for sure. Cause they see like ain't no animosity between me and his mom, mm-hmm. and I can kick it with nigga her people, her step people. Like it's mm-hmm. all good, it's all love. Cause once you don't want nobody, bro, y'all got kids and y'all decide that's what y'all gonna do. Mm-hmm. What's the point of being mad at each other, bro? Yeah, if it's over, it's over. It's, yeah. it's, all, it's all about the kids. Once you have them, once you have them, it's all about the kids. And y'all got two families, y'all come together. Yeah, y'all a big family. Hell yeah. Especially for niggas like say like Boosie. I don't know how many. Well, he got a lot of kids, but for niggas that got a lot of kids and different baby mamas, mm-hmm. y'all got a co-parent some type of fucking. Oh way. yeah, for sure, for you sure. Know what I'm saying so. Man, at some yeah. points, they be kind of good though. Now, for saying uh, been a minute, you say uh, broke nigga claim a hood, they ain't even made no money, money in, <laughs> and that's that's real as hell. It is, man. Niggas claim a hood, nigga ain't doing shit for that bitch. Ain't just, doing. You just nigga, just, you paying rent, nigga living that hood. Nah, man, and, and that's and that was some real shit. Like mm-hmm. you know you. And I ain't fought in no nigga because I was a nigga claiming seven mile. I wasn't making that much money on seven mile, but mm-hmm. I claimed seven mile because I came up like the streets taught me how for the sure. streets really is. For sure. So then I started making a little bit of money. Like it's time for me to really go. Yeah, yeah, I, yeah, yeah. I got the. Yeah, yeah for sure. Yeah. And then, like I said, you went in on this song, nigga, because you said, "Bitch, I'm, bitch, I'm gaining weight." I kept my ass in the kitchen. Nah, nigga, eating good for them days that I didn't. You got, <laughs> nigga, that that could be on any type of level, nigga. Like you could think about that. You can refer that to a nigga when you just was struggling with your parents, and now you are doing this, mm-hmm. or when you were struggling yourself with a bullshit job, now you got a better job. Like mm-hmm. that's what you coming on, like nigga, shit. I wasn't. I wasn't get what I wanted. Now, nigga, oh, I'm eating steak, nigga. Like, I'm telling you, like I was so fucking skinny. I was talking to my friend <laughs> last night. She was like, "I, I want to fuck with you if you was if you was that that small like you was." I was a little nigga, like yeah. real small, and I didn't put on some weight. Yeah, I'm like now, I, I like how I filled out and I didn't yeah, sure. build some shit. So <laughs> I'm, I'm definitely eating, nigga. Ain't you no know, funny thing about it though with with with, with sale, bro, because I be doing. I try to do a little bit more. Like research and shit. That's how I found out about the Gator and shit, dog. That nigga ain't lying, dog. Cause I, I do, I go on people's Facebook pages, bro, just see if I can find like little shit to talk about to surprise them. And I'm like, damn, this nigga was a little nigga, but still had the fucking braids. Like, <laughs> what last thing you haircut, bro? Nigga, I would have to be like seven. For real? Eight. Yeah. Damn. Seven, eight, nigga. I, I grew braids and I was like twelve. Yeah, and yeah. just kept every cent. Yeah. Like, That's your signature shit. It is. It <laughs> is. That's what everybody tell me. Like my cousin, like I should get locks. So I should just get my shit locked up and you I'm like, like uh, talk about that shit maybe you know it's time for this it's a time for a change yeah, so maybe yeah. my know. son got dreads and shit dog yeah with locks because you say that's disrespectful to call them dreads and shit well i mean dreads you know it's different yeah well you know some people who really be into that shit bro like they say that that's like i guess the term that the white people using back in slavery or some shit dreadful hair or something like that mm. so that's why like people who be into that shit with the with the hair dog because they be saying that shit, their hair is power and the locks and shit like that so they, mm. some people get disrespected if you say dreads it depends on who you talking to. I definitely heard that before. Yeah. Now, dog, my, my nigga Sev, dog, hit me up one time. Like, dog, don't, don't niggas be rapping on the show, dog? Like, 
Niggas ain't been spitting lately, dog. So then, <laughs> where the spitters at? Yeah. <laughs> so you know, what I'm saying that's my thing. I've been asking niggas. So if you see a nigga who rap, for the most part, I ask and they want to do it. Why? Some niggas will do it. Some niggas will do it that shouldn't did it. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. Prideful, prideful yeah, but pressure. Then I, but the thing about it, I tell everybody, bro, like, you ain't got to do it. It, could be, it ain't got to be a freestyle. It could be a written. It could be whatever. Nigga, you, nigga, I had a nigga grab his phone. Nigga spit a, a straight verse, nigga. So, you know what I'm saying? My, I, I, I chopped up my nigga, dog. I asked the nigga, nigga, like, shit, what instrumental you want to go on, dog? Uh, and and nigga sent me that shit, dog. So, shout versus everybody. Exclusive moment and shit real quick, man. We... You know what I'm saying? Rapping the shit. Shit, you ready? All right, for sure. All right. Shout out to everybody, man. Seven the building. Yeah, what up, though? Yeah. Yo. I told niggas talk is cheap. Now they got me off the streets. I can better ban this money run. It don't walk to me. Big dog off the leash. Been chilling where the bosses be. Seven mile shit. East side where I often be. Real niggas peep that. Bitches see how we stack. You ain't in my hood. So where the fuck you see me at? Beat the pussy up. I got her begging for a rematch. I started out from nothing. Gold gays in the D hat. Close to my ops. I ain't doing this for nothing. Soon as I get the drop. Niggas ain't gonna see it coming. Circle small like a dot. Still move with my stomach. Either you real or you not. Shit, I gotta stay a hundred. Nightmare. On seven mile with something like M Street, a bloodhound. When it's going down, I can smell beef. Sold everything. It ain't shit that you can sell me. It's loyalty over everything. Ain't shit that you can tell me. No tents on my shit. You can see me through it. Looking like I got the bag, but we do music. I be running to the cash. You can beat me to it. And I don't scam. If I rob you, you gon' see me do it. I'm just focused on this money. Everything else irrelevant. Bitch said she got some good brain. She intelligent. Three for the frames. I gotta take them off delicate. Spent seven on the chain and bought a watch for the hell of it. Keep a bad bitch. And a friend, that's a definite. Don't deal with disrespect. I send them to the reverend, send them to the pastor. Streets raise a bastard. I'm a G. Matter of fact, I'm a dog. Spell backwards. Story of my life, different page, different chapter. Money coming slow, but that hate coming faster. Pull up on my ex with the bands and then smack her. Trying to be a better man. Fuck being a better rapper. Started in the basement. They hate it. I ain't say shit. Barely writing rap, so I can never write a statement. Still eating good. The cheese, eggs with the bacon. Or probably lamb chops with zip sauce on the day shift. Had me pissed off when they said. I wouldn't make it Bossed up on them Now they ass looking basic I recognize real And I don't see these niggas faces Had to get it how I live Got tired of being patient Move like a boss So when I do I ain't announcing that If you copping keys Or you can show me Where them ounces at Need a couple G's And I'll be back Give me an hour flat They love to see you fall But they hate to see you Bouncing back Play the win I'll be about the bag Fuck making friends Waking up Count money Usually how my day begin Trying to flex a 20 Probably hopping out The latest bins And give me five years I'ma fuck with them Bailey twins Feeling like a boss Got a neck full of fun Nah, nigga put me on, this why I'm always getting off Bitch said I'm a snack, I told that hoe I'm the sauce It's about what you stack, never about what you bought It's about what you stand on, this watch got my hands cold You ain't no real nigga, you ain't never put your mans on Used to sip 40s while I'm trapping out the bando Just to hit a shorty, then I put her in the friend zone Real shit to ride to, a boss when I ain't trying to Hating on the nigga, I ain't even got the time to Used to ride bikes, chrome pegs on my mind goose Now I'm catching flights to drop bread off the mom deuce I'm a shine boo, everybody heard it said Walk up in the spot at all these bad bitches turning heads It ain't bad luck if you see me out burning bread Shred and stack quicker than the nigga spread of virgin legs Damn <laughs> Hey dog. Yeah Fucking Seb nigga Fucking over you niggas man <laughs> You come on the show nigga You gonna watch this shit you gonna be scared <laughs> Showers everybody this year What Seb, up though nigga. Seb man Hey nigga went in like a motherfucker dog to, man. Hey yo tell niggas to come on Showers and everybody <laughs> and spill another freestyle harder than mine <laughs> I'm, hey, listen, I'm acting out, but I still got bars. Niggas ain't fucking with me, and that's something like. Make sure y'all cop my new mixtape when it drop, my nigga. <laughs> All, hey, off papers, too. I'm on y'all last, nigga. Shout out to the whole family. Every motherfucking body. Johnny fucking five. Mama, I love you. Everybody, I love y'all. Hey, shout out to the Catalina motherfucking wine mixer, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> love y'all. Hey, nigga. Yeah, he, he just went in on y'all niggas, dog. Y'all got some splendid to do. Like, it's gonna, it's gonna be hard, dog. Oh yeah, it's gonna be hard for y'all niggas, dog. Damn, yeah, yeah, you, you probably you, you and Leaf Frogs from a whole bunch of niggas, dog. You and Leaf Frogs, <laughs> niggas, like, cause I think I'm thinking like, all right, you about to spill a good six. Damn, they're gone. <laughs> oh no, that he it's went. light. I can definitely do some more, but I'm I'm gonna, I'm gonna say that for yeah. the album, though. Damn, yeah, yeah, uh -huh. that's just hard, dog. Mm -hmm. On that e e e e e e e t yeah, e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e Niggas be, hey, it's pressure now. Y'all yeah. come on this bitch, dog. Y'all yeah. know if you a rapper, 
And you don't rap, that means that, hey, that nigga denied it. You ain't a rapper. <laughs> <laughs> that nigga denied it, dog. Shit, niggas down. Tell niggas to come on this show and split out how to freestyle the nigga. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Shit's hard, dog. That was just like, I appreciate that shit. Oh, no, for <laughs> sure. For sure. Shit, I was going to keep my bars in my pocket. <laughs> that shit. That nigga, that nigga shit. I'm going to be like, yo, go ahead and tell my shit in real quick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now, uh, oh, yeah, you can take, you, 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 you take the bitches off. Yeah, now, sure. dog, I got a new, uh, a new segment, bro. Just, you know what I'm saying You're the first nigga for me I'm gonna ask these questions This yeah. segment called Sub me in coach This some shit dog I'm gonna give you either A rap group A TV show or a movie Yeah And you would tell me A person you would wanna Sub in for Okay You know what I'm saying Play that, play that, play that role dog So uh First person First first shit I'm gonna give you Is um Paid in full Who you, who you subbing in for Man that's such a good Motherfucker Um Hell yeah. Sub in. Okay, I would definitely sub in for Calvin. Calvin? Calvin. <laughs> what makes you say Calvin? Oh, nigga? because it's like that nigga had, man, he, he <laughs> man, that's crazy because in so many ways, he was kind of like the big homie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You know what no, I'm saying? fast. Because he, yeah. he, he, just, he just hated. Yeah. You no, know what I'm saying? Sure. If, so, he didn't, if he didn't, man, nigga, the, them four niggas. Uh, Rico, yeah. Mitch, Ace, and Calvin, yeah. they could have took that shit over. Hell yeah. So Hell yeah. I, I would have subbed like in for Calvin and would have just not acted like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You for already sure. was fucking the nigga's sister. Yeah. Hell yeah. Facts. Am, am, am Hell I lying? Yeah. Hell, he's going to put you on if you was a cool nigga. You feel me? So yeah. it's like, nigga, so I mean, you know, I mean. Okay, we explain like that. Yeah, you would sub in and just play a nigga role a little differently. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Hell yeah. yeah. Okay, bet, bet, bet. Who you subbing in on Boys in the Hood, dog? Subbing in for. Damn, that's that's a hard one. Boys in the hood. Yeah. <laughs> Cause I think I would play. I, nigga, be, me being me in the hood. I'm, I, I know you. I, I, I know. I, okay, who would you? Who would you say? I'm. I'm just gonna be cute with dog. Cause I was that nigga in the hood, but wasn't a hood nigga. Yeah. So I think I could do that shit, dog. Yeah, I, I'll probably say him too. Yeah, and that nigga, you know, shit. He was he, he probably was the flyest nigga out of all them niggas. Man, cause his pops was <laughs> pops was, was fu yeah. furious. Hold style. on, nigga. Before we get furious back on there, that's got to be the hardest fucking name ever. Nigga. It is furious. I'm style. surprised. I'm surprised. No <laughs> rap nigga. No, I'm surprised. Ain't no rap nigga named that shit, dog. Put a reference to it, like yeah, I'm furious with these styles, nigga. nigga. If a nigga came out, I'm nigga. that boy in the hood for real. Hell yeah. yeah. <laughs> all right, who you who you subbing in for, dog? Men's to society. Oh, dog. All right, bad, bad, bad. Of course. All right, nigga. This nigga hate this movie. Belly. Who you subbing in for? Ooh, man. I <laughs> wish Sincere was a little bit harder. Yeah. I wish Sincere yeah. was a little bit harder. Hell yeah. But I'm going to definitely say Sincere. Okay, but you going to make that nigga a little tougher and shit? Yeah, yeah. All right. Who you subbing in for, nigga, on Friday? <laughs> <laughs> As he smoking shit, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> shit, uh... I'm going to say this about Friday before mm -hmm. I say who. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm going to just say that that, was, that movie demonstrated so much loyalty. Oh, yeah. How how Craig just stood by. Uh, oh, yeah, for sure. Through the whole, he passed in the strap and he was busting <laughs> that nigga. Hell you yeah. know what I'm saying? That was some real loyalty, some Hell loyalty yeah. shit, though. But I'm going to, I'll probably say, I'll probably say Debo. Debo. Yeah. <laughs> Rest in peace, cousin. Man. He he was he was the bully. All right, on the music shit, nigga. I know it's your, these your niggas, dog. Who you subbing in for on Dipset, nigga? Got to be Jimmy. Jimmy Capo yeah, 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 yeah. Gotta be Jimmy. And it's a rumor That that nigga Ran down on Motherfucking Gibbs And shit I don't yeah, know how true yeah, it is Yeah 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 it, That's definitely a rumor <laughs> What is I think it's, it's true Yeah I think it's true Gibbs my nigga though Gibbs a spitter dog Yeah I, oh, I know shit. <laughs> I, I definitely I yeah. definitely know He's a spitter too Alright who, who, uh, G Unit Who you stepping in for Banks Banks hell yeah Banks. Hard shit Can't, can't be Buck He done did too much Suspicious yeah, he shit <laughs> Can't be Buck <laughs> I, used to, I used to fuck with G Unit though No man heavy Hell yeah, yeah. Hell yeah Hot boys Who you stepping in for Nah, who y'all think I'ma say? Just, just to be honest. I mean, I think you are gonna say Wayne. Nah, but I, but that's the popular thing. But I think you probably say BG. Turk. Turk. Why you say that? Cause Turk was always the laid back one. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. He, yeah. he was, but it's like he ain't reached his full his full potential yeah. yet. And I don't think he had a chance. Cause by the time I think it was his turn, that's when that shit got destroyed. Yeah, he, he got locked up for like yeah, mm, that he too, shot yeah. a nigga. Yeah, so yeah. I'll be I would have been Turk and really 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 turned up. Okay, who you but, subbing in for on Power Dog? The, the original Power Show, not the one with Tyreek. Uh, man. I'm going to say Tommy. Tommy. Yeah, yeah, Tommy, that nigga, dog. That's, yeah, why, that's always my favorite nigga. At first, I was like, 
He and he was loyal ass nigga too though, little yeah. kid. No matter how many times Ghost fucking fucked over him, nigga. That nigga was man, but that's loyal what I'm saying. That's, he loyal to the death. But yeah. man, when you got a nigga like James was, like yeah. you keep on trying me, nigga. Yeah, for you sure. know I kill your you ass. Know, and I can do it. You nigga. know I yeah. can kill your I know ass. Everything but you keep about on you. trying me, brother. Yeah. You keep on trying me. <laughs> but yeah. I but I got your bitch though, yeah. so it's all right. Yeah, for sure. So last, evil, last but not least, dog. Who you subbing in for on BMF? I ain't gonna say meet you, to Terry though. I'll probably say I'll probably say Pat. Okay. Yeah. All right. You just ain't gonna come in that bitch and be no motherfucking uh... crackhead. Because <laughs> <laughs> like you gotta understand this, the, the, the 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 big homies, bro. Like you Dude. know what I'm saying. I feel like if the nigga woulda supplied them niggas and had they shit together, they mm -hmm. woulda took that nigga with them. Yeah, for sure. Them niggas was them niggas woulda took that nigga Pat yeah, with them. Yeah. Pat was just being selfish. No, for sure, for sure. Yeah, that's a, that's a new shit out there. Nigga, sell me in, coach. I know. Hey, y'all niggas been not steal my shit because I know. This is some shit I made up, nigga. <laughs> mm -hmm. I didn't take this from nobody. I was on the I was in the bathroom I'm like, damn, let me see. We gotta think of something different. Mm -hmm. Bet, let's do that shit, nigga. Mm -hmm. Got a little hooping. Sell me in, nigga. So oh, yeah. and speaking of that, the last thing I'm gonna say as far as like with the music and the, and the rap shit, dog. Uh, you know, with who well, with the music, I'm gonna go on the movie shit. Yeah. On hooping and like rapping, you always like you kinda like mimic somebody's game or take a little bit of this and put it with you. Mm, okay. Who do you look at for like in, 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 in acting Like alright I'll take a little piece of that Or I study this person Or you know what I'm saying Like do you got somebody like that Uh yeah Dam Damon Itris Okay That's the nigga from uh, Snowfall Yeah oh that nigga cold Yeah Dam Damon Itris Yeah, yeah that, that that's my show too nigga Yeah man I I got some stuff Coming up with him too Oh for real Well I I, I don't want to speak on it Oh yeah yeah But yeah, yeah. it's, it's, it's in definitely in the works mm -hmm. But um Definitely him mm -hmm. Um I ain't gonna lie man I, I watch old movies like Nicholas Cage, John mm. Travolta, For sure. like and uh Con Air and um Yeah, like like Nicholas Cage and Con Air was crazy and yeah. like him and John him and John Travolta and face off. For sure, yeah, 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 yeah. Classic yeah, movie. Hell yeah. Classic movie. Hell yeah. I watch them type of movies and I just go back on those and just see how them niggas was really doing it. For sure. And just cause they not black don't mean these motherfuckers can't act. They can act. Oh, for sure, facts, facts. Yeah. Hell yeah. Mm -hmm. So shit on uh, music shit, dog, I know you say you're working on a new project, dog. When that shit, when the new project coming out, what's that shit? What that shit gonna be called? Man, it's it's really called Off Papers too. It was called Sober Thoughts, okay. but I didn't came up with so much more material. I've been listening to it. It's been done for about damn. It's gonna be a year. Mm -hmm. Got me some of that shit. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. It's been on for like a year, so I'm like, I'm gonna just tweak it mm -hmm. and just put some more to it. I don't have a date on it yet. Okay. But um, I got the. I'm gonna find out what videos I'm gonna shoot first, for sure. and then I can have all the artwork and everything done for, for sure. it. But for it's, sure. it's definitely done though. Hell yeah, man. Well, shit. And then whenever I drop my shit, dog, you gotta come on that bitch, dog. Yeah. Yeah, man, I was I'm just gonna do. Like I'm just gonna do uh, I was gonna do like a motherfucking. It's gonna be called Throwback Thursday. Mm -hmm. So I'm just doing all like beats from like early 2000s, 90s, and then just flowing on that bitch. Yeah, and that's that's what we need to do because them yeah. 90 beats be so classic. Hell yeah, yeah, hell yeah. Simple beats, nigga, just going off and shit, dog, yeah. going crazy on that shit, bro. Yeah. Definitely. Now I know uh, we had a drunk moment, hot moment on the last episode. You got a new one, a new a new story a, that. Drunk a hot moment. Yeah, you got something new, dog. That you was fucked up, dog. Man. Because the other one you said you was. Yeah, I you had, smashing through. I, I, I threw up on shorty. <laughs> I, threw, I threw up on shorty. Yeah. Yeah. You got you got a new one though or no? Uh, nah, I ain't really got a new one. Though. <laughs> I ain't got a new one though. I ain't yeah. really been, I've been trying to stay out the way from uh, getting too too, too drunk twisted and shit. Up, yeah. Yeah, 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 I ain't got nigga. one though. Yeah. For sure. Well, shit, man. You already know it's love. You come on this bitch, dog. Oh, uh, for sure, man. You been doing your shit, man. Keep I on moving. Boys, and certain man. niggas that come on the show, bro, like niggas and females who like. You be knowing like them niggas going, you know, you be rooting for them niggas, dog. And like real talk, nigga, because you hear nigga, I ain't gassing, but yeah, you want them niggas, I'll be like, dog, hopefully that nigga, you know what I'm saying, pop. No, I ain't no hopefully. I can't wait till that nigga pop off. Appreciate that. You know what I'm saying? Like Diamond, shit, she want them. Like yeah. people who seem like some hard working niggas, you can see like, damn, they doing their thing. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, so yeah. And then niggas be hating, dog, because like, I would love for somebody who was on the show pop off. Nigga, ain't no hate. I'm be like, hey, dog, hey, episode 56. Episode one on one, that nigga was on my shit, bro. <laughs> he was on my shit, nigga. Yeah, nigga had the best rap on this bitch, dog. Oh yeah, y'all definitely gotta get in this bitch and get to spitting, man. Like y'all gotta bring that shit back. Like a lot of niggas just, I mean, that's just me. It comes from the foundation of just being a, a freestyler or just a, yeah. a person that just is comfortable around yeah, for you sure. know, music and shit. So when niggas say I'm a rapper, I'm an artist, you know, if I run up to a nigga right, if I see Jay Z right now, oh yeah, I'm spitting. I'm a, I'm a walk up casually. I got bars offhand. Hell yeah, 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 yeah. Nigga, you, I'm going for and that, five, dog, nigga. Me and with somebody that shit, bro. If you rap, you should always be prepared. You should always have something. Something. Yeah. Always have something. Yeah, like. niggas, niggas just do. It, I think just because everybody else doing, it, they think it's a quick way to come up with some shit. Like nah, nah, niggas ain't really trying to do that shit for real. Even with the podcast, I think niggas think it's so easy. 
and they just come on this bitch and then they sound whack as fuck. Mm-hmm. Like you gotta have some type of personality till you gotta have some type of w- reason for a nigga to want to hear your shit. You know what I'm yeah, saying? For real. Hell yeah, dog. So anything you want to leave people with, dog? As far as you know, what I'm saying what's going on, how I can follow you and all that good shit. Um, shit. Well, y'all follow me on Instagram at seven underscore braids. You know what I'm saying? Facebook, Sev Noble. That's S E V space N E W B L E. Um, Bad Girls Two. Uh, the movie will be on Tubi. Mm-hmm. Beginning of January. Y'all check that out. Uh, shout out to Will. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Howard to her Urban Simplex group. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to everybody. L.A. Love Bros. Crystal the Dow, you know what I'm saying? Carmen, oh, yeah, yeah. you know what I'm saying? I, Shout out I, I, I everybody. Her shit to come on the show too. Yeah, yeah, definitely. <laughs> Shout out to everybody, man. And I got a lot more, uh, a lot more upcoming projects. So y'all just stay tuned. And I appreciate y'all for rock with me, you know? Yeah, for sure. Wait, can you watch the West End too, dog? Uh, Retribution. Uh, yeah, oh, yeah. Um, just uh, type in Retribution on YouTube or just hit me a, send me a DM and I'll send you the, the link to it. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. It's, it's on YouTube. So it's a pretty good movie, man. Y'all should check that out too. Yeah, okay, check that nigga out. He was whooping bar of ass and shit. Like <laughs> <laughs> but yeah man Shit yeah, yeah. Episode 101 dog Got motherfucker Seven this motherfucker Gator and shit dog <laughs> Oh wow <laughs> When they, they come to a screen Near you dog Yes yes Shit dog Shout out to everybody man I'll let you boy Yes sir